Well, it feels amazing, uh, my first win. It, I, I still can't believe it, really. It was an amazing race, a lot of pressure from behind, uh, but then to pull it off, incredible. Well, my expectations before were actually nothing. I just wanted to have a clean race, have a good start, and it all changed when the Mercedes cars touched each other and went off. So then I was, okay, maybe a podium is possible. And in the end, we came out with a win. So yeah, it's just incredible. The race itself, yeah, pretty good start. Um, lost one position in turn one, got it back in turn three. Um, and from there on, yeah, it pretty much followed Daniel in the first stint. Um, from there on, when we put the medium tires on again, I catched up to Daniel, got a bit stuck, but we managed to hold on to the tires very well. And from there on, when we did the last stop, I knew we were going to the end, but it would have, yeah, it would, would be a big task, but we managed to do it. So uh, yeah, it was a great race. Um, well, I was just focusing on um, not locking up and uh, just focusing on getting good exits out of the chicane, and that took a lot of pressure away. I think with five laps to go, I thought, OK, now we have to win this race because I saw Kimi struggling with his tyres as well. And uh, from there onwards, I was just, OK, make no mistakes, get a good exit out of the last corner and that should give you the win. Well, the thing is, yeah, you start to think about it, but then quickly you're like, no, don't think about it. No, don't think about it. And just focus on what you have to do at, at that moment. And yeah, uh, you think about it a little bit and then you go back to focusing fully. My dad was, I think he was crying and uh, yeah, he was incredibly happy. I mean, uh, best result for a Dutchman as well. My dad finished twice third, so now, yeah, incredible achievement from, uh, if, yeah, from, I think, our side, I would say, because he helped me a lot uh, also in, in the beginning of my career up until Formula One. And uh, I think without him, I wouldn't have won today. today. To be honest, I don't know. I mean, this was a great weekend, great result. Um, we'll see what happens in Monaco. The car should be quite fast there, and uh, we just have to wait and see. The target for Monaco, first of all, is just stay out of the walls. And if you stay out of the walls, hopefully we can be close or on a podium.